Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome back to our Ikit Claw playthrough where we have been expanding down into Estelia, having uh, conquered the Blighted Marshes, and uh, also getting Undercity set up in the north here in Telia. We are going to build up, basically we're going to build up the ability to spread ourselves throughout the world, uh, slowly going to spread, spread Undercity throughout the world while we're conquering Estelia. And that's the current plan. If you've got an idea for what a good game, a good end game plan for this, you know, good actual goal for this campaign is, chuck it down in the comments, by the way. Sorry, um, drinking hot drinks because it's bloody cold at the moment here in the UK. Cypress the thief. Hmm. We will see what goes on down there. I'm not planning on doing too much yet, but uh, yeah. Up here, we're just planning on slowly expanding ourselves and you know, slowly expanding our undercities uh, throughout the place. I may send an army north at some point, just just using underways and things to get to uh, far far flung places. But yeah. Go aim for the head. Why am I moving so fast on my turns? Have I somehow inadvertently set myself to fast move? Weird. I don't know when I did that. Anyway, let, let's do our normal allied factions off. Neutral factions off. For the time being. Because do I really care what they're doing? Not really. Oh yeah, and Bellaquint Mars Creek is going to go through there to find out where that goes to. Ooh, where's Forrick Iron Brew starting... Uh, Interesting starting location for him. I, I guess Belagar starts near. Um, Belagar starts near where Belagar. Belagar starts near the Eight Peaks now. So actually, that that does kind of work. Unbending. Set sail across the land. Don't know how long it'll take him, but. I am aware I have a quest battle. I've got no desire to do it yet. I'm going to keep encircling them for the time being. Yep. Extra Undercity, please. Read Warp Scroll. We are going to sail down to Sartosa, because that, that, that feels like a good place to have an Undercity. That or I could go up into Caron. Yeah, change of plan. We're going to use the Underways to head up into up, in, up into Bretonia somewhere. Oh, the, the woods look huge. They are probably some of the best units I can get, especially with the physical resistance, though they do lack armor, but still. Walls. We need defenses. I, I des definitely want high level defenses because I'd be nuts not to. To be fair, we are building up very quickly here. It seems a relatively safe start position, weirdly. I've said it now. Something's going to come. Again, I am playing with the Old World mod guide. It's linked down below in the description. I am currently running in the old build. I'm going to be trying to update it soon because I think it is all updated now. 
However, there's chances this playthrough may just randomly stop. If it does, it's probably because of inconsistencies and thing uh, with the mods. So, just 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 be aware of that, guys. I I don't want to, but if it happens, it happens. I was considering making it big. The question is, do I want to go down here? The thing with Sartosa is Sartosa is not going to spread as well. I think going up here to get myself spread somewhere completely different is actually a good idea. Yes. The nation calls. So I'm going to grab this. So this gives us what? 20 downside is it does consume food. But that ability to spread is really good for us. Where are my schematics? Ooh, he's now got a Doom Flare. Let's have a look. Uh, enabled if casting, everybody in range. What's the range? That's not that great. Adrenaline rush. It's it's okay. It's better than nothing. It's a heal when he's casting, so. I probably want to get the things which reduce the spell damage because one of the great things to be able to do with a character like that him is just charge him into the middle of the enemy, then drop warp lightning on your head. So just charge in, you're like, <laughs> yes, yes, gold, gold. I take gold, gold. Oh, we are. I'm happy with our expansion. I'm going to try and not piss off the Norskans too much too early. Um, obviously, we've got uh, Gulakazar. I'm probably issued, mighty lord. mullering those names. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm aware. I've got quests. Magic missile. Yeah, big paddle. Does get me that, though. Um, but not yet. I'm not ready for it yet. Find soon. Much, much. Now, now. Start much, much. Heal, heal. Kill, kill. Absolutely not. Don't anger me. When I'm angry. I make challenge. It is set. I have no desire to anger you, Mr. World Walker. Mr. Angry Man. The Empire. When will he reappear? Ah, oh, so it's over here. Oh. That's nice. That's such a really nice little skip jump there. Why, hello, Skrullkey boy. Yes. The price. Wakadata. I love his starting position, actually. I, I was very tempted to start as, um, as Scraggy. And it looks like he actually has quite a nice little defensible starting position there. I, I think the mountains are a bit too thin. I think they're, yeah, they're not, but I think they, they just feel a little too thin. That's a lovely little bowl, which isn't being used or anything. <laughs> God, guys, imagine this map, but for Grand Cafe, or Lustria, or anywhere else, basically. Pfft. 
this size map anyway. Some of the things which people are going to do with this are going to be fantastic. No, no. No, 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 no. No, no. Die, die, food, food. No! You come bearing arms. Is it war? That worries me. I may need to turn around. Stop. Yes, yes, kill, kill. Take, take. Harness the, the power. Two more turns, turns. War, warlock, engineer. I mean, I could. One, two, no. I I will head up to Reichland, but we're going to hit somewhere else on the way. Skaven ports. Uh, I hate how slow you move through the swamps. It's still good. We can still get somewhere settled. Uh, he gets a special one, so getting something settled in the north there, and I think he gets settled. He gets a special building as well, no I believe. Time. Experiments to do. No. You die. Literally, looks like they are dying. <clears throat> I'm a bit concerned about uh, Migrolano. Oh, he can't use the goddamn underway, can he? Oh, well, we can keep exploring then. Now, now! Kill, kill. I know I lost some music units, but honestly. Science and sorcery. We're going to be pulling back home, so to get some uh, better units. Engineer of Scryer. More warpstone. Now, now. We will get the Healy one. Where's my my dome racket? Oh, that's quite brutal. The fact I can't just go through the mountains. That scales move. Oh, he seems to be on an absolute. I might just take files off. No, we might go there because it's just got more income. Because it's not like we're not going to be able to expand. Ooh, rebellion. Yes, yes. Rebellion, good, good. More food. Rebellions aren't actually bad for Skaven. That's a weird thing. I mean, fine. I don't want extra walls, guys. Uh, I know he's miles away, but but dealing with him would just be a pain. That's right. Come at me and die. Which kill device to use? Hmm? Let's take the food. Enough, enough. I am a we have dwarves. Okay. That I like for the extra food production. Nice, nice. Expand, expand. Yes. 
More food, food. Where are my schematics? Hmm. Uh, death frenzy. What does it do? Scorch ain't bad. That one I don't think I actually care about. Affects flying units only, which is always a bit dubious as to whether it's actually worth it. Now that's good because it makes me much more likely to succeed in things, but I want to get my spells first, my magic buff first. We're going to grab Scorch. Conspire! Scurry forward! By the comet! Yes, yes, kill, kill. Sorcerer, inventor, yes, yes. I've got plenty of food still, so... Oops, should have sent him into the town. Never mind, we've got plenty of time. Like I said, he is just going to explore the world slowly. You know, uh, until somebody assassinates him. Uh, setting up under cities. It's literally his job. I actually quite like how hard it is to cross that river. Uh, though it's probably not as hard for players, because all these cities do have ports. Harness to the power! Blast wars! No, no, fool! More food, food. Start moving to the extra campaign movement range. That's lovely. Soon, soon, dwarfs, dwarfs die. I know I'll pro potentially lose that, but... Sometimes you got to take a risk. Wait, we all... Oh, 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 lovely! We just expanded into here as well. The Empire. Now, this is fantastic for food, basically. Uh, this Under Empire is going to be all about food production. They are going to be my food skaven. Um, they are not fighters. They are not designed... Want, I don't want them fighting. I don't want them being discovered. They are going to be as stealthy, stealthy as possible while expanding. I didn't realise we could expand over mountains like that. Of course you can. Why wouldn't I think it's water you can't expand over? So we're probably going to get into Bretonia quite nicely there anyway. Lord of the Glade. Lightning strike. I'm still going to go into Bretonia. I may, I may go and get, I may go and settle under the, inventor. under a certain big tree. <laughs> Goodbye. Nom nom. Kill contraptions. <laughs> Scotty spawn fools. Go go. Move. <laughs> Engineer of Scryer. Make it so. <laughs> Field technology, yes, yes. Ready. Push the public order out here, at least to start with. 
Um, soon we're going to rebuild, then we are going to keep pushing into Estelia. We are going to have a network of alliances there, but all my al allies are going to inevitably, eventually be covered in Undercities, guys. Uh, ready to explode. I don't know how long it takes to make them explode, but if they ever declare war on me and I'm struggling, I can just make all their cities go BOOM! The Undercity has been established. You can now extend the Under Empire into this region by building warrens directly underneath the unsuspecting city. Wow, we are expand our under cities are expanding massively. I like like yes yes. More like engineer. Unusually the Halbert version has lower melee defense. They've not got great range, but they are spectacular. Oh, I'm not a huge fan of these, actually. They are really solid, but I, I always find I get them killed. But that's just me. It could just be me. Definitely want at least one of them. Yeah, can't get the best things yet, but we're getting there. This is just a, a, a small rebuild, basically. Nice, nice, yes, yes. And that gives us free and free. And then... That'll do for now. I might, I might add a few more units to it over the next turn or two, but that'll do for now. The Under Empire will spread under everything. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, the fact how quickly it's spreading. I never realised it spread quite this quickly, guys. Uh, it never did for me before. And we are spreading really nicely. We're spreading faster than I can actually pay for it, which is nice, nice. Move north, north. Do you think somebody might be in that region? Ooh, woods, woods on hill, hill. Magic ink missile. I order scary move. Ragatata. I ready. Uh, it's where to go to set that up, which is the thing. I mean, the further away, almost the better. No! Oh, I lost an Undercity. No, 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 not yet. Getting some anti-large for the flanks. Do you think we've got enough weapons teams in here, guys? <laughs> Let's be honest, this is all about the weapons teams, guys. Um... The issue being, it's probably going to suck in autos. I want to get some more peoples. Don't want to cancel that one, though. Nope. 
No, nothing worth cancel. I want to get some more Storm Vermin in because Storm Vermin as my front line are spectacular. I mean, they're not spectacular, but they're the best we've got at the moment. And they will really, you know, they're not terrible. They're not endgame units, but you say that they, they do surprisingly well, even endgame. The Forbidden Workshop has been upgraded, Ooh. granting research access to new experimental parts. This expansion also enabled us to formulate an extra batch of warp fuel, granting precious... Nice, so what does it actually Play give us more? I have the ability to build more Doom Rockets. Go! Go forth and kill! So I can buff warp grinders. Ooh. Yes, yes. See, I'm not a huge fan of warp fire throwers because I always miss. I always miss fire them. Rolling doom. The forbidden workshop has been put to good use, my lord. However, some parts remain unavailable due to the current limitations of the facility. By increasing the level of the Forbidden Workshop, more upgrades can be unlocked. Okay. Right, that's fine though. We're, we're doing we're doing nice. I'm happy, happy. I'm just enjoying exploring the map here, guys. So we found Thranzi Boy. Oh, it like it's its own place. The waker of trees. Oh my god, is everything in here gonna be max level? Oh, oh that'll be beautiful if that is the case. Yes, yes, a level up for Skaven Blight. Nope, nothing yet. We are building ourselves up. We are going to be ready to start campaigning again soon with a new black fur army. So Skaven work the way the darker your fur, the better you are considered in their society, guys. I think that's it. So like the the black fur Skaven become storm vermin, even to the point where low ranking Skaven have been known to dye their fur to make to up their station. Yes, indeed. Yes, yes, Altov, yes, yes. Sorcerer Five turns. Yes, yes. This good. Move chaos. Proud son of Athel Lauren. Well, this way, way. Why, why? No, no. Oh, okay, so it is a faction-wide thing. We are going to go settle under the Oak of Ages. No, we're not. We're going to do Vol's Anvil. Oh, I thought it was per character, guys. I'm going to be honest. I'm, I'm a bit I'm, I'm disappointed now. Oh, I thought I was going to have fun fun. I'm still having fun exploring. We'll still get a special building using him, though. I don't think I'm a fan of the laboratory, that as it sounds. Ooh. Anyway, guys, that is where we're going to leave this one. So with us being ready to push out again next turn, again, we are going to start fighting into here a bit. Ooh. 
that's annoying. They may get taken out. But yeah, we're going to start taking out these guys next. Pushing into Estelia properly and working out our future plans. Other than that, guys, as always, please do like and subscribe if you are enjoying this. Um, comments down below. And an extra special thank you to our channel members and Patreons. Uh, that's Monsterbound, Philip F, Nose Nose, Andrew T, Krataru, Brandon, Space Ace 475, Coding Monster, Jason F, Egg, Scrin, Jared Horn, and our new console member, Good Sir Twisted. Thank you all, and thank you everyone for watching. Cheers all.